One of the best gifts I experienced when I was a kid was my mom's karaoke machine. Now, some of you might be thinking, oh, how adorable. A mom and her youngest son singing songs together. Not exactly. Sure, I was a musical kid who was surrounded by musical talent in the family, but the karaoke machine and me had different plans. My brothers and I, we were obsessed with making home videos with the family Panasonic Handycam, and we just started filming more serious scenes with fight choreography and gunshots. Sure, the film was satisfying, but it was missing that edge. Music and sound. That's where the karaoke machine came in. I discovered that while recording our footage onto a VHS tape, we could plug in an audio jack from the karaoke machine into the VCR and use the microphone to make sound effects while playing soundtrack music on the CD player built in. And lo and behold, our post-production system was established. Was it high quality? Absolutely not. But I was amused and ecstatic at the fact that we just redneck designed a way to make complete home videos. Media and entertainment was like another child in the family. From Sunday family movie nights to music practice at church, there was a constant noise around me. Not to mention, all of the choir, band, speech, and theater classes I was involved in, both in high school and college. And because of where I'd been, I knew that the future I was setting up for myself was going to be one filled with beautiful noise and entertainment. Composer Hans Zimmer quotes, If you talk to any director, they'll say music is 50% of the movie. As a frequent moviegoer myself, I would always make the game of name that composer as I was viewing a movie for the first time. I tuned my ears so well that I could pick out specific swells in the music and instrument selection that would lead me to guessing who scored the movie. About 90% of the time, I was usually right. To me, the soundtrack of a film is like jello. It helps the medicine go down smoother. And when sound is added on top, well, to piggyback on what Hans quoted, I believe both the music and sound together make up about 80% of the film. I can say that with confidence because I have an aunt who is blind, and she enjoys going to the movies just as much as I do, and often she picks up on things that I don't notice. She sees the movie in a completely different way than most people. We see a screen with pictures accompanied with audio, whereas a blind person is drawn into a whole new world simply through what they hear, and without the distraction of noticing that they're in a room staring at a rectangle with moving pictures. Jesse Schell, in his book The Art of Game Design, writes, Sound is what truly convinces the mind is in a place. In other words, hearing is believing. And thanks to Skywalker Sound, the most remarkable places I've had the thrill to visit are the Star Wars Galaxy, the Marvel Universe, Middle Earth, and many more. Bearing witness to these things has stirred up a passion in me that has been there since the days of making those home video films, and that is to take people to new worlds through what they hear. I believe with the extensive skills I can bring to the table, I would be a major asset to the Skywalker Sound family. My portfolio consists of a self-made library of original sound effects through Foley recording and advanced mixing techniques, original musical composition pieces for film and stage productions through Pro Tools and Sibelius, an extensive record of voiceover work and years of full audio production credits from freelance projects. But more importantly, what is going to be your main advantage? bringing me into the family is my willingness to follow orders, learn fast, and lead where direction is needed. With a bachelor's in performing arts from Shattern State College and a degree in audio production from Full Sail University, my ability to stay creative at work in a fast-paced environment has been put to the test and proven me to be the right tool for the job. At the core of all my credentials and skills is the driving force for my inspiration. To bring a new perspective to sound in entertainment by immersing the listener into a higher plane of emotion and reality. My whole life has been about finding and helping others find those higher places. And as a follower of Jesus Christ and serving in the church, my mission in the workplace, at school, and in the streets has been to bring hope, 
healing, and purpose to everyone I encounter. In fact, when Jesus walked the earth, the words he spoke was like a beautiful sound for those who felt oppressed by religious laws. After all, Jesus did say, he who has ears to hear, let him hear. What we can imagine and create together is not just for one select type of people. Music and sound is the language of the universe. Everyone can understand it because it bypasses the mind and impacts the heart directly. It is because of this realization I am convinced that the path to becoming an audio producer could be more than a career for me and an opportunity for you. It would be the beginnings of bringing peace, balance, escape to that higher plane, and fulfillment to every person that hears. Imagine with me the worlds we can create together, all because of a karaoke machine.